Hello. Here's another section of Johnny Cash's old tractor barn. We're trying to convert it into something very special for the times we live in. This is a little reading area for kids and their, their uh, parents. This is my grandson here, Ezra. He's a deep, deep reader. I think he's reading Shakespeare. Let me see. Oh, no, it's Elvis Presley. Okay. Then I have another grandson over there. Of course, he's a teenager, so now he's putting on a skit for us. It's called Hide and Go Seek Skit. And that, and, but earlier he did say he thought this was a very special place. How about Sonia, our daughter? What would you like to say about this experience? It's relaxing. It's she, comfortable. Comfortable, relaxing. Comfortable. And over here at the bar, we're gonna serve coffee. Okay. I'm gonna buy the coffee, big containers of it every day from Dunkin' Donuts and maybe donuts because we're not allowed to cook or do any of that. So anyway, or you can bring your own little food, read, but it's a chance to get out of the house. Uh, we may or may not have music or, now we have over here this very important stage that used to be at the uh, Opryland and it's actually a cover wagon that converted into a stage. My understanding is millions of people saw this at Opryland, but we were able to purchase it. Now, here's my grandson. He's about to exit. See, this is the way it is between grandpas and grandsons. Very challenging. Get a close up of his face. He's actually quite a young man, uh, all the ladies out there. Hey, hey, okay, never mind. All right, and uh, over there we have the one piece of the time car. Okay, he's exiting, he's exiting. My grandson is exiting. Anyway, I just thought something like this would be a special place. We're gonna charge very, very little uh, maybe just donations, but if you want to get out of your home and just do a little karaoke, I don't think we'll ever have more than 20 or 30 people in this room. So, boy, from a social distancing standpoint, you'll have tons of space. And that's my goal. Just this, I think we're going into a tough year and I wanted a place like this where you could get out of your home feel safe, read books, look at history, all these toys and antiques and listen to music. Thanks.